Hello friends! So I'm here to do a little plan with me. So we're gonna do a plan with me and we are going to plan for the week of, let's see, is it July 9th? No, it's the 13th. I swear, like, time has no meaning anymore. Let me know if that is true for you down below as well. Also, a quick little plug. So I'm really trying this year to get to 10,000 followers. I think that um, being able to share links with you guys with that swipe up feature would be amazing. So 10,000 followers over on Instagram. My Instagram is at creatinginchaos underscore official, and it's linked down in the description box below. So if you come across this video or you are one of my subscribers here and you're not following me over over on Instagram. I would absolutely love your support over there. I try to post one planner picture and then one like lifestyle picture so you can kind of get a little behind the scenes and I post that daily. I'm also really active in my stories and I love to go live over there so I'd love to have you hanging out. Also just a quick note I will be updating my Patreon as well very very soon. So if you are one of my patrons thank you so much for hanging out while I basically took a little Patreon break so thank you so much for continuing your support. I I love all of you and if you would like to join my patreon the link to that will be down below okay so this plan with me is super fun it is another collab with one of my friends from the black community okay so her instagram handle is cat plans 2019 and her youtube channel it's called cats creations so both of those things will be linked down below she is a mom she's a grandma she's a dog lover and she is a meal prepper she is also a happy planner her spreads are gorgeous. Her photos are super creative over on Instagram. She is just so fun and positive. And every time I talk to her in the DMs, I just feel like I want to smile. Like she is just one of the sweetest humans on the entire earth. So make sure that you follow her on Instagram. Make sure that you subscribe to her channel and make sure that you check out her video that is linked down in the description box below. So for this video, we decided to do a free spirit or kind of like a boho theme. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be pulling from the free spirit sticker book. I also got out this everyday essential, not everyday, it's called essential planning. <laughs> the sticker book is called essential planning. And then I also grabbed out this color story book that I have two of. It has a layout in here that is like a boho layout that I have some pieces left of. So I'll probably throw some of those down in there as well. So what I want to do first First, though before we start is go ahead and get some I would love to get some checklists down so I actually want to use the ones from the color story book because they are my favorite okay so I have five of these ones so again I'm pulling like scraps together because I've used parts of each one of these books to kind of make full kits before in other planners so yeah <laughs> I'm working with a few just pieces here so I'm not sure if I want to use all of these colors or if I want to use just a few of them oh and there's none of those okay so I have five of these and I thought there was like one other color that I could use that would match. Let's just see what we have left. Oh my gosh. And I got a comment and this is not like no shade, but I got a comment the other day that was like, I'm new here, but I'm not really sure about your singing. And now I am totally aware of all of the singing that I'm doing every time I talk. So if, I don't know, let me know down in the comments below, the singing or not the singing. Like, what do we think about it? Do we love it? Do we hate it? I can work on it. I can take your criticism for sure. <laughs> but I just thought that was so funny that that was something that I did not even notice that I was doing. Okay, so back to this. I'm off, I'm off topic already, you guys. I'm off topic. Okay, so, oh, there's like a purpley one that I could use here. Okay, so that's six. I need seven. Okay, there, and then there's two here. There's like a burgundy one that I can use here too. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and get these down. I think I am gonna use all of these colors just so I can kind of pull all of the things in, but I'm going to give you guys a little bit of music and then I will be right back to chat with you. Yeah, yeah. For what I have put you through I still have you on my mind My mind My 
focus, been drifting away from you. Just wasn't our time, our time. You can say, you can say who you want, but I know you hurt at night. But I tried and I tried and I tried to hold you tight. So I'm here tonight. And I'm giving us one last chance. Cause I don't wanna lose what we had. Cause I'm not feeling right. And I'm tired of this loneliness. Let me prove it cause I swear I will. So this is what it's looking like so far. I feel like I do need to like do something with the sidebar though, but I'm not quite sure because the sidebar stickers that I was going to use that I thought were in these color story books are not in there. So <laughs> that is not going to work. Okay, so that one is too bright. There was one in here that I thought could work. Okay, so like this purpley one, but I feel like it's too light of a purple. I wonder if there is a long one in like one of the wellness sticker books or something because those sticker books sometimes have like similar color palettes. I'm going to check this one more time because it seems silly to me that there would not be one long <laughs> sticker in this whole sticker book. That just seems a little silly. There's a bunch of double boxes. There's some monthly boxes. Okay. There's some of these decorative type things. There's some full boxes and I am filming this quite late at night. So it's possible that I missed it the first time I was flipping through, but it totally looks like that is not the case. Okay. So let me look in some of these things and then I'll let you know what I'm gonna do. Okay, I think I have been a problem solver. So this is the Be Happy Box, It's Your Year to Shine sticker book. So this was from 2019. These stickers, I have barely even touched them. So there are a couple in here. Okay, so there's these two that I can use. And I think what I will do, I'm just kind of looking at this with the peaches and stuff I think this will probably be the better option so I think I'm gonna do that one and yeah and I think I am gonna cover up that little swimsuit with something I don't know quite what I want to cover it up with yet but I am going to okay so I'm trying to figure out how I want to do this I kind of think because it's just not that long do I want to just cover up this notes space and then put something else down there? The problem is that I don't have white out and I know you guys keep telling me and I am just a fail. You keep telling me to get white out and I don't. So that is definitely my fault. Okay. So I think what I'm going to do, I think I just figured it out actually. Okay. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to use this cute little box or there was another one that I saw this one right here, the daisies in my hair, peace in my soul, that one. And we're going to just cover, start covering things. Okay, so this is one of those times when I would cover something or cover a whole bunch of some things just because what's on the page right now doesn't match what we're going for with this particular theme. If it was just me, I probably would just try to match it with what's on the page. But this is a fun collab. And so we are going to get out our creativity and we're gonna do this because it's so fun. We're gonna cover this little guy with this love box. And then I think I'm gonna cover the little swimsuit with this guy right here. Perfect. Okay, I think that will look really cute. 
and I know that it's July, so I'm fine covering that. Very cute. I think that's gonna look great. And then what I would like to do is if there are some of those like washi strips kind of cover just this purple line, it just, I mean, it kind of works, but it doesn't work quite as well as I would like it to. But before we do that, I'd like to also maybe put like a little, I don't know, like a feather or something in this space or a sunburst or maybe one of those, although there is rose gold right there. Oh yeah, a little feather should be cute. Just in the interest of bringing in like all of the colors, I think I'll put like this little teal one just to kind of bring it in. Although it's kind of a smaller one. Maybe this blue one, we'll just kind of see. I feel like inevitably <laughs> I always end up with like all of these stickers all over my hands just because that's just how it goes for me. Okay, that's cute. Do I want another one? in there I don't think so I think that that will that'll work okay so that looks cute and then I just want to check and see I thought I saw some like washi strips in the sticker book but I could be wrong I could totally be wrong I feel like they put those in a lot of the sticker books now just because they are super functional and a lot of people use them. So I'm gonna use this little sticker right here. It's a little hard to see, but it is a really cute, fun pattern and I'm gonna off center it. And I am going to then add another full box on top of that. You guys have been seeing, I've been loving this layered look lately. I don't know what is going on with that. I'm just feeling it, just feeling it. Oh, and there I break out into song again. <laughs> I apologize to whoever you are if I totally scared you off. I did not mean to. Always take the scenic route. Moonchild. Focus on finding your wings. Wonder seeker. Oh, this is me right here. Here we go. This is me and I need to put this in my planner. Kind heart, fierce mind, brave spirit. That is me for sure. Okay, so we're gonna put that guy there. And then I'm gonna put like a functional box of some kind right here. Get it done, the plan. We'll use one of these little the plan stickers. We'll put this guy right here. Oh, and I have been meaning to update you guys. So some of you have been asking and I appreciate that so very much. But my dad did have his hip surgery and his second hip surgery in like a year. And so now he has both hips that are not of his making. <laughs> so he's got new hips, he's a brand new man. He's calling himself like the bionic man. He's gonna be running like he's 25 and he's healing really well. So he was even like joking with my mom. My mom was like, I, cause they are just so funny together. They don't necessarily, I wouldn't say that they argue, but they like razz each other. Like they give each other a hard time. And <laughs> she, he was like asking for all of these like all of these things and she's like I'm gonna give him his pain medication I'm gonna give him like a margarita and I'm gonna hope that he goes to sleep <laughs> and then he was telling her that he needed another margarita because he needed to stay hydrated <laughs> and so he's clearly healing very well <laughs> doing just fine. So that's how that's going. Dad's doing great. Everybody's doing great. And yeah, so that went really well. So that actually kind of made me think of something. We are hoping to go see them this week to kind of check in on dad. So I think I'm going to go see them on this day on Wednesday. So I think we're going to go do that. So let me find a little, a little sticker that I can put there to, to signify that we're going to go and see dad so yeah that will be good and I kind of don't want the burgundy one I would like another color if that's possible but now I'm just throwing sticker books all over the place oh there is another color I do have okay so I think I'm going to put this here we're gonna use this tealy color one Oop. with oh my gosh I don't think that's gonna restick there I'm gonna hope that that does <laughs> But I don't know if that's gonna happen. Okay, so I'm going to put that there and then I'm gonna put this little note to self sticker over here and that will be, that will be that. So note to self, visit the parents. And I'm thinking I might need to add a little bit of deco in here. I feel like a lot of my spreads lately, I'm like coming to love them once I like get all of my pen in here, but not before that. <laughs> I don't know why. I'm just not like loving my before the pen spreads. I'm not sure why. Let me know if any of you guys have that 
have that situation going on too. Oh, and I also have payday on Wednesday. So let me get out budget. I like the budget stickers because they kind of match my spread, but there are some cute payday stickers in this sticker book also. Although I think I've used them all. Yeah, they were in here. Looks like I do need to get out budget. Oh, and I am going to be getting groceries. Grocery shopping is going to probably happen. Oh, I don't know. Probably Wednesday or Thursday. Uh, it'll probably be. I don't even know, guys. Okay, so not the auto pay. Payday, and I would like it to be, which color would I like? Probably this teal one. I like these little corner payday stickers too. They're very cute. Okay, and but this has to come off of the discs. <laughs> so one thing that I really like about these collabs is number one, I get to meet a bunch of new friends. Well, they, we were already like friends in the planner community, but like I get to know them and like check out their channel and like really dig deep on their Instagrams and stuff. And I also get some accountability to make sure that I get all of my spreads done <laughs> because I feel like that's like the biggest struggle for me in my planners is that like, I'm just like, oh, I don't need to do that right now. <laughs> I'll do that later. And then later never comes, right? So I feel like I am... I'm getting some accountability buddies with my planner. So for all of you who have collabed with me, I appreciate that so much and it is needed. It is very needed. Okay, so this half of the week, pretty much no plans at this point. There are some, let's see, clear quotes in here. Wild and free, look up and get lost. Steer by the compass of your soul. I liked the foiled ones, but those, Oh man, they are very difficult to photograph. If you've ever tried to photograph a, a foiled sticker, you will know they are difficult to put on film, on the camera, and then also difficult to, apparently the non-foiled ones are difficult to get off the page. Oh, but did this one not get cut correctly? Yeah, oh man, don't you hate it when that happens? I don't think I can do that. I can't live with that. Oh man, well that's a bummer. That one was gonna be good. There are some, I think there's like a clear quotes page in here. And I apologize if I'm all over the place. That's kind of how I do my plan with me's. A lot of you guys say that you like watching me like flip through the sticker box, but I don't know. I kind of wanted a bigger quote though. Okay, oh, there's a, another wonder seeker. Wild and free, dream, go where you feel most alive, have a brave heart. Let's try this go where you feel most alive one. I am going to cross my fingers that this sticker is cut correctly. It is looking, oh, it's not looking good guys. It's not looking good. This whole page I think is just a little bit off. <laughs> you can see that. Oh man, that's a bummer. Is there another page of these? I wonder if these, well, what is dream? Oh, dream is probably gonna be the same. Man, that's such a bummer. Dream looks okay, but I can't live with that. I can't deal. Well, that might be out. Clear quotes, you're letting me down. You are letting me down here. I am taking a long time to pick a quote to come down on my page. Oh goodness. It is very late at night, friends, because this is the only time that I have to get this kind of thing done at this at this juncture in my life wonder seeker find your wild let's see is this one this one looks like it's cut correctly oh yeah this should be good and that's pretty big i think that'll take up some good space okay so find your wild i love that that's really cute and then i think i'm gonna put maybe a double box up here so let's see which double boxes we have to work with my mantra Free spirit. I don't think I should use this color because I've used a lot of it already. Never be afraid to dream. So I love this sticker book and I kind of want to use this sticker, but I don't like using the dream catchers because I feel like they're cultural appropriation and I don't really feel like that's something that I want to support. So I'm not going to use that double box, even though I really want to, because I like the message and I think it would fit really well right there. That is not something I'm willing to do. I like the, I like these sticker books. Like I like this style and I wish that, I wish that it didn't say things like gypsy and didn't have dream catchers in here and that kind of thing. Um, just, and that's my own personal little 
a little rant, but oh, I don't know. I just, I don't feel, I just don't feel good about that. So I'm not going to put that there. I kind of wish, and I, so I didn't buy any of the other like Dream Seeker or other like boho vibes kind of sticker books because I was like, well, I already have this one. I don't need multiples of different things, but Apparently, I need more <laughs> options than what I currently have because I only have a few sticker books with with these options in it. But that is okay. That is fine. If nothing else, I can layer some stickers again because that's kind of fun. We could do, we could even do some foil. That could be fun. Yeah, I think what I'll do is I'll do these feathers. I feel like the feathers are also cultural appropriation on some level as well. I don't know. I feel like they are a little bit more generic, so I feel a little bit better about using them. If that is incorrect, feel free to let me know. Again, an open book, open to criticism, happy to learn. So feel free to let me know in the comments. And don't you don't have to preface it by I don't want to meet be mean, but like you don't have to worry about that. I can I can have a conversation with you guys and not take anything personally. So feel free to let me know. I'm totally open to that. Okay, and I will just put this little box here because that will give me another space to write a little something if we need that. That looks cute. And then there are also, let's see, some like longer stickers in here. They're not double boxes, but they're like these kind of stickers. Wild and free. Find your wild. Have a brave heart. Steer by the compass of your soul. I kind of like this one. I'm going to kind of test that out and see how that would look. Would that be, I don't think that would be too full. And that could be something else going on in that day or like a note to self. Yeah, I think I kind of like that. Okay, and then maybe just a little something up here, like a little box or something. There were some like one, two, three, or like remember boxes, some to-do boxes. Let's see, what color didn't I use very much of? Today to do remember, let's try, well, I used a lot of that already. Let's see what else we've got here. That little checklist is cute. So is that one, so is that foiled one, but I feel like I used a lot of that. Well, I guess I didn't. I think I'm gonna use that foiled checklist right here and then we'll just label it. And this will be like a weekend, an extra weekend checklist. Hello weekend. I feel like even though my kids are out of school and I'm out of school, weekends are still like my bonus time. I feel like I'm doing so many things this summer. It's unbelievable. <laughs> I thought summer and I think I swear I think this every year and I don't know why I think it every year because every year I'm like man summers are super busy like why did I think it was gonna slow down I don't know why I thought it was gonna slow down it just it really never does okay so we'll put this here and then on top of that we'll put a little I don't know, like some kind of label for what this checklist is going to be. Don't forget, reminder, important, priority. Yeah, we'll go with priority. And we'll go with rose gold. And then there are some little, like I feel like a lot of this spread are decorative, or not decorative, but like functional things. So I'm going to put in some decorative things, whether they're like little stars or these little triangly type things. Yeah, so we'll put, I'm gonna put some of these in and I'm going to do this off camera, or not off camera, I'm gonna do them sped up to music a little bit and then I will be right back. Say you can say what you want, but I know you heard at night. But I tried and I tried and I tried to hold you tight. So I'm here tonight. Alright guys, so I think that this is my spread all ready to go. I have a couple of pen things to put in here, but not too many, just a couple. So I'll be right back and then we can chat.
Okay, so my other things are pretty much before the pen. So this is how my spread turned out this week. So don't forget to also follow my good friend Cat Plans 2019 down in the description box below. Follow her over there on Instagram and make sure that you also subscribe to her YouTube channel, which is linked down below in the description box. Also make sure that you watch her video and leave her some love. I cannot wait to see how her spread turned out. And oh my gosh, this looks like a complete just like blank spot. <laughs> so make sure that you check out Kat's videos and thank you again Kat for collabing with me this was so much fun I'm so glad that we got to do this also make sure that you check out in the description box below the playlist of all of the black creatives from the planning community that I am collabing with and I plan right now to collab with folks through August 31st but if there is more interest I will definitely continue doing these because I'm having so much fun and I love having this like planner accountability and meeting new people and you know amplifying voices that need to be amplified in our community. So definitely make sure that you check out all of those folks down in the description box below. And if you'd like to find me in other places, don't forget to follow me over on Instagram. I am trying to hit that goal of 10,000 followers to be able to share links with you guys and swipe up things. So make sure that you follow me down below so that we can build our community over there. Also make sure that you follow me on Facebook and Twitter. I do post things over there occasionally. Make sure that you also follow the Spiced Chaos podcast where Leanne and I have so much fun every week together sharing all of our shenanigans and all the things. So make sure that you follow us there. And if you would like to also, um, you can follow me over on Patreon and all of the things. So thank you again for all of your love and support. If you're new here, subscribe to the channel. I would also love to have you following me here. And I think that is it. So by the way, friends, have fun today.